I'll tell you when we need help and that's when you'll be here. Like tomorrow from five to 10. I'm kind of busy on Friday. Uh, maybe we should just shut down the whole place till you're free. <laughs> okay, I'm from New York so I can tell that you're being sarcastic. What we do here, whether it seems stupid to you or not, really does help people. So we're not looking for your feedback at the moment, okay? Welcome to the Women's Center, Layton. See you at Poetry Night. Look, I know you're in charge or whatever, but I really think it would benefit you to take things a little less seriously. Let me guess your type. His name, Gareth. His dad, the Monopoly Man. And his hobbies, uh, they include sailing and benefiting from generational wealth. You forgot belittling waiters, but yes, otherwise that's about right. Well, that sounds like my personal nightmare. Are you one of us now? Oh, a women sender person. Um, are you insane? I can't believe you, Dyke. What? Yes, this Dyke is taking a little bit off of me. Whose side are you on anyway? Do I know you think you're tough, but you are fucking five feet tall. I am five foot two. Okay, I am so, so sorry that that happened. I'm just this queer girl that they can't fuck. But you, you're this pretty, blonde, straight girl who they actually think is worthy of respect. You're wrong. What part am I wrong about? Whoa, I was, like, really wrong about you. Shut up. I always used to rush away after sex, too. Order some Postmates, maybe watch some Indian Matchmaker. I think I like you better than anyone I know. Oh, no. That is so sad. We've only known each other for like four weeks. <laughs> okay, well, I don't like a lot of people. But tell me that you like it. Get off me, little weirdo. I need to put on a rainbow bathing suit and run down the street screaming, I have a girlfriend. You have a girlfriend. Do I? Yeah. I just, I just want to know that you and me can exist outside of this one room. We can. I'm, I'm gonna go. Uh, should we just like get out of town tomorrow? Go somewhere we can be ourselves. Sounds nice. Alicia, you you posted that. My purse is in the background. People are gonna recognize it and and know that we are in a hotel room together. Layton, you're being ridiculous. I'm serious. Take it down. Fine. I can't keep dating someone that's closeted. I feel like you're bringing me back in the closet with you. I've already been through this. I don't want to come out and become all political and have it affect how I act and speak and dress and what things I do. The thing I... you so desperately don't want to be is me. I really care about you. But, but if you can't be out with me, I can't be with you. Then I guess we're done. I came to say that I, that I really miss you. I do miss you. I also want to move on. And like I said, I don't want to go backwards. I, you need to move on too. I was seeing someone and I fucked it up. I fucked it up because I am fucked up. It wasn't a guy, it was a girl. I'm gay. The only way you can be happy is if you're yourself.